Hello, boyo, and welcome back to a brand new generation. Welcome back to another installment of Jubilee January. We're in this bitch. So I mentioned that we were gonna pick our next video and the rest of the videos for the month uh, through the community tab. And then I remembered I'm new here. So I'm gonna just pick random ones. And then the last one, I'll go ahead and stream it. We'll all have a good time. Maybe we'll watch a couple videos. Maybe we'll make content. Maybe it'll be a secret stream. I don't know yet. I'm living on the edge. So I don't know what generation I am. I'm 90% sure it's like Z or I'm a millennial. I don't know. Like I was born in the late 90s, so I can enjoy the 90s nostalgia but like most of the stuff i experienced was early 2000s so i don't really know what i am other than a fucking unit yeah! but i do still find the arguments between generation z and millennials very funny the argument of uh skinny jeans harry potter receding hairlines a lot of my favorite topics that i don't really get into so i figured the best thing for me to do is figure out which generation i am through a jubilee video so we're gonna go ahead and see six Gen Z's find one secret millennial. So I'm either gonna identify a lot with the millennial and dun dun, that's me, or I'm gonna side more with the Generation Z and be able to spot out who I disagree with and that makes me Gen Z. So let's go through this whirlwind together, fresh watch on this, let's get it so this is the part where i tell you to subscribe to my channel like the video if you liked it tell me how, how's your day going you know and subscribe to that so let's see if i am a millennial or a gen zer sound a race i don't like that i'm gen z i'm gen z i'm gen z I'm Gen Z. I'm Gen Z. I'm Gen Z. I'm Gen Z. I love these videos because it does add an element of like, am I smart enough to find them? And then it's like, no, I'm really not. If this series goes well for whatever odd reason, I just thought it'd be fun and it's more consistent. Uh, I would love to audition to be in a Jubilee video. I would love to be the f odd one out. I feel like I knew enough of the theater kids without being one that I could fake a lot of situations well enough. Nah, man, I totally thought you were a carpet installer. I, I thought you really were talking about, it. you were talking about all these details. Nah, nah, I I'm just a light skin. That's what I do. Bro, my heart's beating so fast. <laughs> okay, I know. Favorite movies growing up, childhood movies. King Kong. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory. Uh, Easy A was one of my favorites. Mine was Hairspray. High School Musical, sorry, yeah. anyway. Yeah. yeah. Keep High going. School musical. High School Musical or Camp Rock? Camp Rock, any any Disney series. Okay. Charlie and the Chocolate Factory? Charlie and the Chocolate? First of all, the best movie ever made was the SpongeBob SquarePants movie. You will not convince me otherwise. We got SpongeBob, we got Patrick, we got Mr. Krabs, Plankton, Scarlett Johansson played the main girl. Don't even kid yourself. Easy, eh? <laughs> Love to see your grades. <laughs> Easy A. I've never heard someone say their favorite movie was Easy A. Even of that like era, like super bad, was hilarious. I don't know. I don't know about that. I disagree. I don't think, I think he's lying. I think Easy A was a terrible film and I stand by it. We should say how old we are. I'm 19. I'm 21. I'm 22. I'm 19. I'm 24. I'm 23. I'm 22. Wait, am I the youngest one here? Yeah. Sure. Yeah. Is everybody on TikTok right now? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, as far as recent trends, what have your favorite trends been? I don't, I don't, ugh. TikTok is no longer, oh, are you a millennial or a Gen Z? TikTok is just taking over the world. I put a comment somewhere that I mentioned, you know, TikTok is like kind of running the world now. It's wild. And someone told me to touch some grass. Now, I don't know who that person was, but like, what are you talking about? Murders are attempted to be solved and corrupted because of TikTok. Everybody's using it from children to elderly people. How about instead of telling me to touch some grass, you touch something other than my comment section. Tell me to touch some grass. I'm busy touching your mama. Okay, that's, I, I can't say that. I can't say that. I didn't say that. I don't know, I watch a lot of dogs. So I'm trying to think of the one, um, 
no Gen Z person talks about dog videos. So that was a little bit suspicious to me. All right, so I'm just going off the top of the dome. I'm just going off the top of the dome right here, right here. This girl, she's making a terrible case for herself. I just think she's really anxious and bad at answering questions. This, this girl, I don't think she's a millennial. She's being judgmental as hell. That's a Gen Z quality. This one, no clue. This one, not a choice. This guy, no clue. This guy, he just likes Doja Cat. She mentioned musically, huh. My bet is gonna be middle dude or fat chick who really likes dog videos, which I love dog videos as well, and cat videos. I am i don't know where I'm at now. I could be a millennial. Wow. wow. Why did they vote out Alyssa? What was the reason? Because she took charge? I think she's Gen Z. I don't know about, I don't know about all that. What's like y'all's like favorite type of music? Um, I'm really into R&B, hip hop. Daniel Caesar is a top artist. I'm like very generic pop music. I don't a lot about music, so. Yeah, country or very generic pop, like Doja Cat for sure. Yeah. Wait, whoa, 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 whoa. I think that goes to show just how talented Doja Cat is that she got country music. She got people in country music going, I love the tractors. Uh, I like, I like my girls with the boots. I love the boots. Uh, what else do I like? A uh, Coors Light. I love Coors Light and uh, that Doja Cat. Oh, I, that, oh, that kiss me more. It's a classic. That's a goddamn classic. Does everyone have a job? I work in travel nurse recruiting, so during COVID, we recruited nurses to go work at hospitals. Oh, nice. Cool. Uh, I'm a music teacher. Oh. I graduated 2019, like right before. As 24, I was the oldest person in the box. What is a millennial? Hold on, we need to answer this. What is a millennial? Or Generation Y, as in why would it matter? <laughs> Stupid. 1980 and 1995. So if you're 24, okay, we got a nice little breakdown here. Gen Z is anything 1997 through 2012. Okay, okay, so we're we're within the age range, but that's sus as shit. Oh, I should have Zara and Urban Outfitters. Money. And ASOS. <laughs> oh, I love Target. Just, <laughs> All right, come on. She said Target. That's it. Case closed. I'm calling it now. She is the millennial. I am calling it. It is her or music teaching boy. But I, I don't know, man. She picked Target. She's a nurse. She's very quiet and reserved and scared of them as I am scared of, I think I'm a millennial. I'm scared of Gen Z and I think that's the most giving take uh, to consider myself a millennial. Oh, what's your favorite cartoon growing up? Oh my God, The Last Airbender? Um, Regular like, show. Jimmy Neutron probably. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, the Nickelodeon shows. Kids Next Door was mine. Their cartoons were pretty good. Couple great ones were missing. Couple great ones were, you Steven Universe, SpongeBob SquarePants, which I think would obviously give away the Millennial. Gravity Falls was phenomenal. Mm. Mm. Comment down below what you think of that because I don't agree with it. See, that is YouTube trickery 101. I just got you to comment to something that you think is happening real time, but it's not. I love your shoes. You said you model too, right? Yeah. How long have you been like doing that? For like a year or two now. Well, have you seen, I'm curious, have you seen beauty standards change at all? Because I know that Jen, like, Gen Z has done a really good job at like breaking down barriers. Mm -hmm. Oh, like body positivity. So it's one of these two girls. I'm a hundred percent. I'm a, I'm a thousand percent. I've never been wrong day in my life and that day's not gonna be today. It's her or her. I have no doubt. Yeah, or just like, like on, like there's a runway model that was pregnant like the other week on like swimwear in Miami, which was really dope. When was everyone born? You don't have to say the year, but like. March. <laughs> January. Oh, we're in March. March 7th. March 11th. Hey, Pisces? Yeah. That's what's up. All right, guys, I'll be honest. My sign is. But people don't believe me when I say it, so I don't know what to tell them, but it is what it is, so. Ryan's to my right, and I hear this homie breathe super loud. I think he's just the most suspicious at that point. Yeah, he was breathing. It's a pretty millennial thing to do, so I'm gonna have to vote Ryan. Is that really how, Rayan, Rayon? I don't wanna make fun of his name, I just wanna know what they're saying, Rayon? I hope it's Rayon, I think that's a cool ass name. I don't think it was him. I love his fit though. 
Okay, I have a question. Oh my god, we're gonna find, find out. Oh wait, no, we're not. You... I had a question about your job. So yes. you do nursing? I, I'm not a nurse. Re I recruit, recruit nurses. Oh, so you're also in recruiting? Yes. Oh. Okay, dope. Yes. Okay, cool. How'd you get in recruiting? Uh, like a LinkedIn post? That might be the most boring conversation I've ever heard in my life. I'm not, I'm not shitting on them or anything like that. So you're in recruiting. Oh yeah, I'm in recruiting too. So uh, what's your LinkedIn look like? I agree with some of what she's saying. I remember a little after dial up, but I also saw the transition of the iPhone being sold out, seeing it vividly and people being like, oh yeah, like the iPhone can do this, uh, can do these weird games that no one ever wanted to do. And the internet, I remember some of the weirder parts. Uh, I'm not gonna list anything, but cups and jars were brought up and I've never been the same situation um, that I had to deal with so I was like I had to like change my path really quickly and so I'm like oh. Ruby was talking a lot about more adult stuff per se and she sounded very well spoken and so I thought there was a possibility that she is the mole. No, bro, I just feel like I can't relate to y'all because you're older than me. Even though it's like two years, I yeah. just feel like it's still awkward. That's another good point too. Generation Z and Millennials, there's a big difference in how time is looked at. And I talked about this in the last video. <laughs> I'm a millennial. I know that for sure because I'm paranoid. Ugh, what am I talking? I'm just ranting. I'll just be talking to y'all like a long lost cousin. No. What? Nah. <laughs> Please. Oh. Nah, it's Ruby. Nah, it's Ruby. Doesn't Come on, y'all. Hold my hand. Hold my hand. It's Ruby. I'm right. Now. If the light turns red, that means the mole is still in the box. Oh my god, it's red here. Am I wrong? Yes! God. <laughs> um, yeah, so this is the last video I'm gonna post on this channel. I wonder who it was. Will the millennial please step forward and reveal yourself in three, two, one? I knew it. I knew it. No. I knew it. Can I be honest? Yeah. I voted you first round, uh -huh. and you want to know why? Why? Because you're wearing cargo shorts. That's insane. Well, I guess I'm not a millennial. I don't wear cargo shorts, so. Guess I'm Gen Z. I am 29 years old, and I know that I look a lot younger. My nickname is Babyface Trace because I have looked the same since I was 16 years old. So Good I came you. in being my younger sister, who is actually 24 and is actually a music teacher, and I, everything that I answered was my younger sister. Oh! Oh, you didn't have to do that. You gotta pick that up. Uh, let's see what the comments say. You know, let's take a little peek down here. Wow, that's so funny. The most millennial looking ones to me were still in the box. Chloe, I, Chloe, you get a like from me. I agree with you. Yeah, they're in their late 20s. I'm surprised they won. Wow, not a lot of love. Hold on, let's get in here. Hopefully they get back to me on that. Thank you so much for watching my video. If you want to go ahead and be a part of the Boyo generation, go ahead and subscribe. Hit the like to build my ego just a little bit more. I think I just spit. I'm sorry. Comment down below uh, your favorite generation. My favorite is Jen, what? I might love you, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye. I'm gonna keep putting little Easter eggs at the end of this. Uh, I, I'm gonna go eat something.